Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 9 of Suzaki and Mia now, so let's gotta get, ugh, so let's gotta get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Let's see what happens today, because, like, I feel like these two might kiss today, but at the same time, of course, you're gonna, like, no. I can't imagine, like, what the dub is going to be like when they get to, like, last week's episode and probably this week's episode, because, oh, 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 it's like, are you kidding? <laughs> oh, it was too good last week, and I feel like it's just going to be even better this week. And, and that's what I love about this show. This show is like a... what I would like to say, like a slow burn. It, it's, it takes its time, but it's still good in the end. And sometimes you need that. You can't be like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Even though a lot of us went, <laughs> uh, you need those little lasting impressions and long, like, touches and glances and everything just makes you feel good instead of like ah, I can't it's too much <laughs> they better kiss today if they don't I'm fine with it I can wait a couple more weeks even though we're almost done with winter anime I, you know we need it before the show ends before this season ends of the anime
It's only five minutes. Five fucking minutes. So hold up, hold up, wait, wait, wait. Let, let me talk about one more thing. So you're telling me also, the chairman, that dude who with his eyes closed, that's freaking Megami from Jujutsu Kaisen? That sounds nothing like him! How, like, he, you can see, and it's worse because he voiced that one dude and, um, I'm being threatened by the world's most handsome man. Still sounds nothing like him. <laughs> the title, oh my god. Yeah, so you literally have to tell him, like, yes, I'm ready to be with you. That's all he wants to hear. That's all I want to hear. And then y'all go on a date and y'all kiss. <laughs> I love the fact that he has to <laughs> that's like when you're watching an anime you ask your friend that's a good looking guy is in it be like yeah Mm-hmm. You. Oh, bless you. Oh, never mind. I just found girl for no reason.
Unfortunately. I feel like he's going to say yes, so I'm at the festival, like, oh, we better see it before this episode ends. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, but I feel like he's gonna end the YouTube! It's like, oh! <laughs> See, we love that. We fucking love that. I love a man who's like, or, like, they're like, I can wait for you. Like, uh. Yes! Poor baby. <laughs> At least wear a mask, babe. Huh? <laughs> Are you not feeling good either? No. <laughs>
<laughs> See, for me, this season that we're currently going in is the worst because it's slowly but surely summer year slash springy, aka allergy season. The worst season for me. I literally hate going outside. <laughs> I know. No, you don't. <laughs> I thought so too. You're getting there. Sir, are we dreaming this now? <laughs> I 
Yeah, where are you meeting Sasaki? Oh, oh <laughs> of course. <laughs> Perfect. So perfect. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Even though we didn't get a kiss this episode, I'm okay with that. I am fine with that. We were very, very close. So effing close. Like, oh god, at the beginning. If it would have happened at the beginning, like, <gasps> I would have held my breath the whole episode. <laughs> but okay. Now it makes me wonder, since we are in, like, the first half for the cultural festival and getting into the second half next week, I feel like that's when we're initially going to have me and I'll be like, yeah, I'm going to date you. I want to start dating. <sighs> if it is. <sighs> like, I wanted to be next Sunday so bad, but at the same time, what's worse is because <laughs> the only day that I have off is Wednesday and next Sunday. <laughs> So it's like, you know, you want next week to come, but then at the same time, you're like, no, push back. No, no, no. Mm -mm. But. <laughs> <laughs> but it was sweet. Like, oh, even just me and I'm taking care of Suzuki. That was adorable. I'm sorry. That was so freaking cute. That kind of gave me feels so much fruits basket from when Yuki got sick and Tori was taking care of him. I'm like, oh, why would you? Oh, <laughs> 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 sorry. Oh, oh, they would title episode 10 love. Like, I can't. Oh, this is going to be like freaking, um, made some uh, all over again with the final episode when my baby's finally kissed and I'm just like <laughs> and I was just crying like can you imagine me if this was like I had binged the made some series like years ago way before it got on Netflix and it was like I think two o'clock in the morning and I'm in my room like cheering and crying my ass off because I was like yes <gasps> Finally, they kissed, even though, you know, still today, even in 2022, I still want a continuation of that to see the true, true ending. Same thing with Oron High School Host Club, because if you think about it, all these, you know, old animes that are getting, like, reboots are coming back, and they're getting, like, their true conclusive ending, aka Fruits Basket, maybe Tokyo Mew Mew when that comes, because, of course, that's gonna be, like, the same length of the original series, but you're like, hey... What about Oran? What about Midsummer? You know, because every single time when you when somebody talks about Oran, the first thing that comes out of their mouth is like, we need the season two, or we need like a whole thing, a whole freaking thing on the show. But <laughs> like seeing him take care of Sasaki once again, that was like the best freaking moment. That in the first few minutes of the episode, and oh, I can't. <laughs> I just can't. Like, I really was expecting them to kiss today. But I think the, the, the thing is, they're saving all, like, the really, really juicy bits that a lot of us are waiting for for next week. And I'm okay with that. I really, truly am. Like, what I love about this show 
for the last times that we've been talking about this for the last few weeks is that it gives you enough but then at the same time it leaves you wanting more by the time you finish the show um the only thing that i could initially like compare it to besides kaze san is like how you how people like feel um with like attack on titan or something in the way you know you know how like i hate like <laughs> when shows like abruptly end getting like okay hey you know to be continued and stuff this show kind of does that but it does it in a more like non-subtle way as like attack on titan or when i got into death note the first time or um anything where it just like abruptly ends or it's like oh hey here's a cliffhanger and such but with their cliffhangers it it's subtle it's very similar to when i watched the entire series of we cross we cross when i reacted to that show so many years ago and unfortunately yeah you can't see that because you know youtube you know fucking deleted that shit um <laughs> uh, it it gave it a nice conclusive ending that by the time i finished the show are really the first see the first two seasons of like the entire story it gave it a good ending and then when i watched the movie it can continued on that ending and gave it a big more satisfying satisfying conclusion that i even till today am okay with even though like after when the show was completely done and they decided to make a new series that new series is not the greatest because i dropped that show like after four or five episodes i don't really know i don't remember but yes, I'm honestly really fucking excited for next week. So hopefully, fingers crossed, you know, we get that confession. One, we get that kiss. Two, we get embraces. Three, they start dating. Four, ish, do all that of the things that you do as a couple. That's all I want next week. Please, like, give it to me. You know, we've been waiting long enough, but it is time. If it is next week, it is time. So... <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 9 of Suzaki Domino. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Sunday for episode 10. Bye, guys.